Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. I mentioned at the end of last year that there would be no optional bug fix rolling out at the end of December for both Windows 10 and 11, and that was because Microsoft said that wouldn't roll out due to the holiday season. Now, shortly we are expecting to get our first optional bug fix update in the next week or so for Windows 10 and 11. And this is just a quick video to let you know that the latest uh, Windows 10 Insider build has made it down to the release preview channel, which brings a lot of bug fixes and actually two new little add-ons, two new little features that we could see possibly roll out in the next while. Now, the latest stable version of Windows 10 version 21H2 is OS build 19044.1469. And when this next um, build of Windows uh, 10 rolls out in the next week or so, that'll take it to 19044.1499. And if you're on 21H1, that'll be 19043. And if you're on 20H2, that'll be 19042. Now, if we just head over to those release notes quickly, um, where Microsoft just uh, discusses over at Windows Blogs some of the fixes, which was rolled out a couple of days ago, but nonetheless still relevant. Uh, you can see there are a couple of fixes here that will be addressed in that first optional bug fix update, which we could see rolling out shortly. And then they also say uh, that they've added, there's two little add-ons here in these release notes. The first is to do with uh, the news and interests feed, where they say they've added a new feature um, to the news and interest that provides you with direct access to select your Microsoft Edge profiles from the news and interests and that you can also go to Microsoft Edge then directly from news and interests in the same corresponding profile. And then another little mention they've got for a little add-on and a little feature here is um, they say we added a new feature called sync your settings for users who are migrating to Windows 11 original release and you'll use sync your settings to automatically back up a list of your apps to your Microsoft account and then you can quickly restore those applications on a Windows 11 original release device. This new feature will deploy over the coming weeks. So these little these two add-ons and all these bug fixes are still in test phase so I'm sure that once um, they've passed testing and because it's in the release preview channel we could expect to see um, that late latest and first optional update for Windows 2022 rollout for Windows 10 in the next week or so, bumping up um, the latest version of Windows and 10 21H2 to 19044.1499. And I will leave a link down below uh, to this post over at Windows Insider blog if you are interested just to check those possible up and coming fixes and add-ons coming in the next week or so to Windows 10. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.